Hello, Recording 7, and welcome back to Strategic Command World War 1 with the Empires in Turmoil DLC. We are, of course, in the midst of the Russian Civil War, and we are leading the Whites onwards to victory. Uh, we are starting to push slightly deeper into Russia with our ultimate aim of securing Moscow, which is still a fair ways away, to be fair. Uh, but we have managed to besiege Petrograd, although taking it may be another thing entirely. As we head deeper into Russia, things we want to concern ourselves with include the fact that the very capable Polish army won't go past the Ukrainian borders and we also have a lot more partisans we have to deal with which although aren't uh, usually things we have to fight unless I forget to put units in the right place it does constantly drain our forces and we have to leave garrisons behind uh, so yeah but we're in a good place so we'll have to see how much further we can get in this one so without any more further ado I'll just hand you back over to the live twitch audio logistics for the south that's really good Although we're not suffering too much in terms of supply with our big push at the minute, but undoubtedly it'll affect us later. Okay, leaving infantry to their fate. Oh, hello, train. So this might be a bit of a race of fighting spirit at the minute. But no, we will take both. The Cap Lowitz Pooch Pooch is against the uh, launched against the Weimar Republic. Okie dokie. And it's been defeated. We've got another Polish Army Corps. Uh, well, you guys have kind of got enough here. Are you sure I'll drop you then this way? I'm not sure how much you shall be. And we've got some Zeppelins. I'll bring you up here. So it seems like fun. We'll continue to stand here and stare at the supply and hopefully it gets better. And actually, it has got better. Now that I'm doing less silly things with Perm. It's still not good enough to do anything. Again, I may have uh, caused my been caused my own problems there. How are you guys getting on? Now we're starting to see a little bit of success. That's good. Now, this is a, a core against essentially divisions, so not unexpected, but it was a tough fight. But certainly slightly frustrating just the way it panned out. Beautiful. And now you need to start marching north, and supply is going to be garbage for a few turns because that place has been shattered. You're claiming it's a five? I don't believe it's going to be a five. I would like to scout a little bit north because if we can make the jump up here, again, it's just another route in we kind of unlock. I'm not sure how much value there is in that. Okay, that town falls. We're going to start pushing our HQ forward as well. Just a little bit of scouting with our cavalry. Hey, Ducky, that's looking not too shabby at all. Uh, you need weapons? Have some weapons. Oh, you guys all need weapons and need artillery. I will take the time to do that. You are absolutely just going to keep marauding north. Is, oh, well, I need to take this because I can't leave it for the poles because it's just the wrong side of the border. Uh, yeah, I'll take that three to one before we get started. And then just move north. Ah, oh, poor beautiful. You finish them off, which actually lets me heal you for turn. HQs continue to advance. And um, yeah. Push. push, push, push. That's really nice. That was a good little oomph. And we can start heading up towards Moscow. Hopefully, we can close the summy pocket here. 
no bueno. Ah, they retreated, I suppose, it's something. Uh, that's fine. Quick check for artisans. You're going to head north as well. Well, you may as well come over here. Help out. Uh, Babrusk, what are we going to do? How do you solve a problem like Babrusk? Probably with a Ukrainian. But I'll leave you there for now. As expected, there are people in Sm Smolensk. Are you okay for partisans for just now? Oh, that's right. I need to take a 30 second break. I'll be back in a sec. Good. Right. Petrograd. Yeah, you won't really be able to get involved, so I think... I think... That's not empty. There's a blooming tank there. Not really as far as you can go. It's kind of disappointing. Okay. Alright, we're going to move our artillery around. I'm not going to bother attacking these boys into Petrograd for just now. It's frustrating as it is to be a bit slow about things, but needs must. Let's see what that tank does. Yeah, these guys have recovered themselves. That's good. Uh, you're probably getting yourself murderized with supply. Yeah, you'll have to turn back next turn. There is no one there, though. Let's threaten it. Didn't go our way. Uh, you need to turn there. I'm trying to operate you next turn. Yeah, so partisan wise. Let's have you come south. You are going to take that partisan position there, and one of you guys is going to take the one here. Might as well be the chap at the back, I suppose. Wait, actually, you don't need to stand on Novgorod. Not gives as much eyes, but that's actually where we need you. We need you there. I need one of you guys up this way. I really want to kill that tank and take that town. Okay. Three, four. Are we... Might be able to do it next turn. Might be able to do it next turn. Uh, let's start. The good old, um, what you call it, surround. Let's get that going. Okay, you guys push north. You're clearing out. Uh, you haven't done anything yet. Fine. Uh, you've got a spare hundred. That's already going. 
we can put that up to level two. That would be useful. You guys got your logistics. You've got your mobility. Uh, another one in infantry. That's probably everything we want right now. We do anything with Poland, I'd be tempted to maybe do artillery weapons, just get that better. Or we can make your airship better since we've got it. Yeah, why not? You got upset, but we're not in Moscow yet. Yet! We will. This is a storming train of Russians here heading towards Moscow, but there's a few stops yet. Yeah, that doesn't really bother me, actually. That was a foolish thing to do. Awesome. Okay, yeah, Ukrainian infantry. That's really oh, you turn artillery. That's really helpful. Actually, you guys really need artillery. To be perfectly honest. So this is just a flipping stalemate now. Uh, okay. Who knew even Ural, Ural Mountains would have such poor supply issues? You're going to head in towards Saratova. It's going to be a couple of turns, I think, yeah, before supply really improves there. You guys can need to kind of scout about. We can always take, take Benza fairly easily. Okay, slow going. Uh, do you know what, let's do it. Let's see how 2-2. Two, two. Start to pile a little bit of pressure on. Doesn't quite go our way. Uh, that one wasn't so bad. Let me move up, close out the zone of control, and then we'll head you north as well. Can you that? You can. 2-1, I'll take that on a headquarters. Lovely jubbly. And then hopefully we should be able to smash this guy and take curse because the headquarters is not very good at defending. The beautiful thing is, once you take a headquarters, all the troops uh, fight worse. Bye bye. Might not be able to actually get into curse. That would be disappointing. <laughs> Oh well, if they rail someone in, um, they're going to have all sorts of trouble. No, nice little kill there for nothing. I'd like to be able to get all the way through, but no such luck. Yeah, this Ukrainian Guard Division is not doing anything. You're not on a partisan point. Actually, your job's probably going to be coming and take that. Uh, and you need to keep moving west with your old buddies. We're going to get ourselves in position to start putting pressure on Chernigov. Ah, uh, you might as well have him. Why not? Since we're here in the neighbourhood. Yeah, and your job's actually to come around and help help cut us off. Why not? Okay, that's. We're getting there. Ah, uh, yes, this lovely chestnut. All right, well, let's throw our heads at it again. Skulls out of whatever, see if we can't break it down. That's not a bad start. Uh, 
What if I put you in? We are attacking trench positions. Hey, infantry level one weapons. That's helpful. Ah. Well, that rather resolves that issue because we can't cross the river. <laughs> so we're kind of done there. Uh, yeah, go bomb that guy. Why are you under supplied? Attached to HQ. Oh, you've got two, have you got two units? If we do... Okay, you are attached to HQ now. Don't take the guard units, man. Pointless. Pointless things. I've got another core here who I'm not going to have a job for because you guys are about to all get left behind. There's no other points. You already defending that with poles. That's over the river. That I think is my guys. We could we could send you over all the way down here actually to help deal with these guys if we can't get rid of them otherwise. So why not? Meanwhile, I think I'm going to operate you, you lot to get you closer to the front. Uh, although, how far can you cross much? Yeah, not that far. Let's do it. Can we get you up there? Tempted to do it next time when I'll be able to get even further forward. Nah, it's fine. Is it fine? Is this far enough? Yeah, do you know what's okay? And I'm out of money. Okay, you're force marching along the rail line, as are you. I'm sure we've got some players. Alright, I feel like we're starting to make some chunky progress. We should, we're, we're not a million miles away from Moscow on both sides. We've got a big nut to crack, uh, that's very true. I, did I neglect to deal with some people? I did. I'll right, bring you down. I think you need to pull back and just heal up. Mm, lots of forces here. The parts on there aren't going to be an issue while we're doing our attacks. So let's you already moved. I don't really want to move you there, so I'll move you down here. We all just kind of get a bit closer. Will you have any supply? One. You might be able to push in next turn. Uh, hopefully one of you can take it. Okay, I need to stop doing that and heal you up. You're not getting the rolls. And you, I want to see if I can send you any useful. The answer is not really. Oh, I guess you're going to come down here. I might as well do that. Alright, be careful. Or can you get not far enough? Alright, that's okie dokie. Oh look, that's empty. Nice. Okay, you're going to hang about exactly there. You can't move. You're going to end up in Volg to help with supply, and we're going to keep eating these little towns. We are making progress. You are capped. Uh, I'm going to buy one more Ukrainian core. I don't even know if they're going to get here in any way meaningful time, but fine. That's what we're doing with your points. Poland, what was I getting you to invest in? Airship development. Ah, yes. For the lulls. 
You're going nowhere. You actually have points for once, but you're so far behind in the um in the research game. I'm not sure there's a lot we can do for you. Sorry, uh, Northern Russia. Okay. We don't have a huge amount of time. We've got to the end of the year. What? The free corps crush the communist uprising. Which one of you is a Polish? They bring someone in. I mean, they're just dead because you have such low readiness when you get railed in. So that's not so much of a problem. Wasting all my shells. Stop it. Okay, that was quite painful, actually. As I suspect, this might be no interesting. Questionable. Oh, stop throwing units at me. Yeah, things that still looks okay. There's 56. Our lowest is 56. So yeah, I think we're. I think we're all right. Right, you are Latvian. You're Estonian, you're Latvian, you're Lithuanian. Who's mutinying? Don't know. Yeah, I could do some more troops over here. So let's bring you over this direction. Uh, yeah, you guys push in this way. You're going to cut the railway line so that train can't go anywhere. Now we're going to start to squeeze it, Connell Top. Kind of have too many units here. Can you guys get across here and then without just dying? Um, maybe. What I might need to do is get you to uh, come in a bit closer to assist, or do something like that. Now, likewise, this artillery is no longer needed here. In fact, would be better served uh, down here. This is a bit of a threat. Let's pull you back. I don't really like making these backward steps at this stage of affairs, but I think we have to in this instance. But I'm also kind of... Well, well, Ukraine's I don't want to slow down. I'm okay with the Poles, because I don't have anything else for them to do. I also realised I didn't start in the right place. Well, I'm not even going to look at that. Nothing's happening there. I don't think anything's happening here. Stuff can happen here, though. So next time, supply is going to be a bit better. Indeed. Okay, there's people there. Uh, yeah, we need to be careful about how far we push this. But are we certainly with this these kind of infantry forces, I'd like to think we can beat up a guard unit and seize that town. Maybe won't go for the cut this turn actually. Uh, here, you need to keep pushing forward. We enjoy beating up garrisons. That's probably uh, a little risky. Supplies not 
ideal. But we'll be okay. Guys in Kursk should fall. Uh, not quite as as um as easily as I hope. I'm gonna give up that prepare attack so I can bring in the tanks. Tank battle run Kursk. Who would have thought it? You retreat. Uh, let's bring these guys forward to finish you off. You have bad times all round. Let's see if we can't make a push towards Oriel and smash this HQ in the face while we do it. <laughs> I just can't keep up. That's okay. Uh, partisans. Oh, that's fine. None, none around here. Starting to get into the note. Right. Let's just push you guys as far forward as I can. Oh, I'll take some planes there. We drive close to Moscow. Ah, oh, it's not. It's not worth it. Oh, wrong button. So I think I'm just going to force much up like so. And we'll just one turn's worth of it. That's readiness, morale, etc, etc. But that'll be fine. Uh, so we have done over here because we did out of turn. You guys are okay. We'll see if he pushes in and attacks the HQ. It's not a terrible move if he wants to do it. They're a bit weakened, yeah, then we've got this fun times over here, so we'll keep scooting around. Ah, you're going to come take this. And I think you're going to go have a nosy towards Yaroslav. Okay. Yeah, we're we'll getting for just now. We'll get some trenches built and then we'll get the fins up to full speed. That's not what I was promised. In fact, that was the reverse of what I was promised. Do I get it back? I do. Was it worth it? Debatable. Okay. And then I think we're going to try and start to squeeze out some of these. We really need to clear, if we clear it, actually these two to get an, an extra tile attack on Petrograd. That would be super handy. Oh, sweet. That's really good that you guys can take that. I'm slightly worried that well, a train can't take it. In fact, I'm tempted to send my Finnish unit here down towards to threaten the south and just this little guard unit to help clear these things out. Cool. Alright, I think we're making huge progress now. You're capped. You are capped and you are broke. Oh, you've got a little bit of money. If anything, it's probably too late for it. But I'm going to do it just in case. Let's push, put a bunch of money into there for you. Uh, purchase. 
Oh, we can get Wrangle. Nice. Um, mm -mm -mm. Right, let's give one more of you. And then maybe back to the whites. Uh, do you know what? I would, wouldn't mind. I don't have any. Another cal cavalry division. 253. Okay. Just to help support in here. I feel like I've got enough infantry. Just someone else to do, you know, maneuver, cut, cut, off, cut the lines, all those good bits and pieces. I mean, we may as well threaten Orsha, shouldn't we? Uh, if I go into purchase for Poland, no, it's just Poland. It was fine. Hmm, okay. Uh, if I could afford it, probably getting their um, weapons up wouldn't be a terrible idea. Right, let's move on. They keep dropping the fighting spirit, so do we, but I think that's going to stop soon. The Northern Whites capture an armoured train. Sweet. We have a train battle. And that's what draw this one to a close. So it definitely feels like victory is not a million miles away. Moscow seems tantalizingly close. Oh yeah, not quite close enough to uh, stop those fighting spirit drops. But soon, a few more towns and we'll be able to see the city in the distance. Although, uh, while well, that's going quite well, Petrograd remains a stubbornly tough nut. And uh, yeah, it's a bit of a head scratcher as the best way to crack that. So we'll have to continue to try and and manoeuvre ourselves into a winning situation around there as we push deep into Russia on the rest of the front. But all that we'll wait for next time. So uh, we'll try to close, and I'll see you then. Cheerio!